Good day YouTube, Down to Bricks here. Got a haul video for you guys today. Feels like it has been ages since I've shot a video. Of course I've been down to the Canberra Brick Expo and I did get quite sick at the end of the show and uh, I've pretty much had a week off of doing anything and you probably still hear it in my voice. But I've got this haul and I want to share it with you guys so I can start getting in and getting some of it built. Now, not a heap here. Um, I've kind of got some of it off camera here, but not a great deal of stuff here that I picked up from the show. And it's really just because of the prices. Um, the convention prices are extremely high, and it is hard to find a good deal. It is good to see some of the older stuff that you don't normally get to see. I did pick up a couple of older sets, but again, the pricing... Um, yeah, it, it does uh, it does make it a little bit hard to come home with a nice haul of Lego brick. These boxes here, I've got a special delivery. I'll tell you more about that one. A couple of brick link orders as well just to help beef this up. Now, I did get some comics as well. I might just actually just start with those and just quickly show you these. Went round with Ozzy around Sydney and um, took me to a couple of comic stores. So I got a couple of Deadpool comics and I couldn't come home without a Batman comic so pretty stoked to pick those up now speaking of stores yes the pricing is a little bit high I really like it when you get a store there that actually just sells stuff at their regular price and that doesn't happen very often but I'm Rick James Bricks. He had a store there. He didn't have a lot for sale, unfortunately. Not a lot of sets or anything, but he had all of his custom stuff. Citizen Brick and Brick Arm. So I picked up some awesome stuff off Rick James. And check this out. So, 20 bucks. I mean, that's, that's the store prices. You get a nice assortment of weapons. Check all that out. I mean, there's just a crap load of weapons in there. And i just got some individual pieces here as well. Uh, I'm not going to get all these out. You can see some swords and machetes. and So, got quite a quite an assortment there. Got another weapons pack here. This is just a, a value pack number one. So, very cool. Again, nice assortment of weapons. Ah... Uh, Got this bad boy as well, so that's pretty cool. Look at the size of that. So that's awesome. A heap of weapons. Uh, what else did I get? Oz bricks. Picked up a couple of minifigures. Got Vitruvius. <clears throat> Me, I'm having trouble talking, guys. Modok here. So funny story about that. Never picked up that set. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, but over the years, I've slowly managed to pick up every single minifigure from that set and probably end up paid a, paying a lot more than what I should have if I had just bought the set in the first place. So a little less than there. Sometimes it's better off just buying the set. Met a awesome young bloke down there that was um, displaying Jasper. Good day, Jasper. He uh, had an Exo Knights display. Uh, Ozzy had a very nice gesture that we actually picked something up for him for his display to help him add to it just to encourage him because he had a great little display there so we got him a Nexo night set and he come back and gave us a little gift in return so that was very nice nice of him thanks for that uh, let's um, let's save those ones let's go on to a brick link this is from uh, out of the Czech Republic all new bricks from Sawan and all it is is some of these big 8x16 tiles there's uh, six in there and they just they'll come in quite handy um, let's let's go on to this one so this again brick link this is out of France actually and this was a store called brick attack and I'm hoping these have stayed in reasonable condition because I, I want to open one and I want to keep one and it looks like it's going to take me a little bit to get into these 
but I've always collected these from Lego Shop at Home, these, these little promo sets, but I didn't have anything to order this time, so I ended up just buying them, uh, which wasn't too cheap. Let me, I've just about got them out here. Here we go. And yeah, they've uh, survived pretty good, I think. Yeah, oh, a little bit creased, not too bad. So I got a couple of these classic night packs. So really like these packs, so I'm keen to build one of those. So let's put that over here. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. So old sets. I picked up some old classic Spider-Man sets. Now I got these from Toys R Go. So I picked up this one here, 4854, and really wanted it for the Doc Ock, because I think that's a fantastic looking Doc Ock. So I got that old set, and it's even got one of the old trees in there, so that, that's pretty cool. And I did pick up another old Spider-Man set and I just love these old Spider-Mans we got they were so cool and the Origins 4851 so again we get uh, an awesome Green Goblin I did have a little problem with this set is that the mask here isn't in the set but he has promised that he's going to send that out so I'll keep you guys appraised of that and as soon as I get that part I'll be getting that built <coughs> oh, again sorry for that guys I'm just uh, struggling a little bit here now I've got this box already open couldn't help myself had to have a look at it a couple of weeks ago on the AP stream one of the guys that follows the stream kimchi bricks you guys know him he actually mentioned that he'd found some of the newer superhero set so I know this is coming out everywhere now but I couldn't help myself I contacted Kimchi and asked if he could send out one of the new superhero sets and at the time it was the um, the Doctor Strange set and the new Civil War Spider-Man set so let's uh, let's actually get it out of the bubble wrap I opened the box but I didn't take it out of the bubble wrap and here it is you beauty. Alright, there it is. Check that out. Thank you very much, Kimchi Bricks, for sending that out to me. Really, really appreciate it. He uh, really, really looked after me there and um, got that sent away for me. So, very kind of him. Awesome looking set. Now, I've got all these Spider-Man sets here now, don't I? And check out that Spider-Man. I just can't wait to get a look at that guy. It's actually what I want to do this haul for because I've been a bit down and out, a bit miserable with, with a bit of sickness. So I'm going to build a Lego set and see if that will make me feel a little bit better. What do you guys reckon? That should do the trick, shouldn't it? So I've got some of these old classic Spider-Man sets. I'll get in, get those built as well. want to do an actual comparison with some of these awesome Spider-Man minifigs because this new one, man, I just can't wait to get a look at that. But that's it guys, so like I said, not a not a huge haul by any by any means. Um, lots of different goodies so pretty stoked with some of those comics. Can't wait to get in, do a bit of reading there. But overall I think it's not too bad. But I really appreciate you guys watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, I'd really appreciate that. Let me know what you think about some of the items I've picked up here and what you'd like to see first and uh, we'll get stuck into some of these sets. But thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.